but we fucked up that remedial English class because we were smoking pot and not in college. Right. We can't move on to college, can we? So like now we're not in college, are we? So how do you move on to a new place to shop if you haven't taken that remedial English class and you've got all these pieces of the puzzle that won't fit together and your parents are like eating blood wafers? Grow sideburns. Sideburns. They really help. Really? Yeah. They give you that distinctive look. They do. Like standing out in the crowd. They really do. They really do. And I... That's why I don't think I fit in. Because you don't have any sideburns? I can't grow them. Why not? I just, they just don't look right. I always cut them off. That's terrible. See, the problem is you can't find the puzzle. The guy watching Price is Right. I wanted blood wafers. No, I wanted See, the puzzle. They have one. They have one with your family. You just haven't been to the right place. You haven't seen the ones. It makes it easier to put it together when it's your family member's face right there in front of you in puzzle pieces. It's just that you don't know the fat man. But when it's your family, you realize what it's all about. No, but see, I bought the the puzzle with the round the treadmill and the farm and the uh, the uh, decapitated goats. That's the problem. You have to get the ones with the wafers and the bloody trousers and your family. But I've already got all these puzzle pieces stuck together that like are a part of me now. That like I mean you can't separate once you like become part of the puzzle piece, you can't really separate yourself from it anymore. So that makes you an artist. I know, but I've got to get some more puzzle pieces. You're an artist. You make your own pieces. Use wafer. Use pieces of wafer. Use thumbtacks. But what am I going to do with all these weird puzzle pieces that weren't even supposed to be a part of me in the first place? I mean, I, I tried to keep my eyes open. I mean, I tried to, like, I tried to be very aware of what puzzle I was buying. And when I opened the box, I tried to be really aware of, like, the pieces and making sure all the pieces were what was on the box. Can I? But then I showed the pieces together, and it was too late. It was, like, all these disjointed, like, body figures and stuff. And I tried to convince myself that it was a flower, but it was not a flower, man. And it was not a flower. And you know I, why, right? I'm telling you, I know the answer, and it's this. You, do you remember when you were talking about putting the, the thumb, the push pin, and, yes. and then... And the blood. Right. Doesn't it all make sense now? No. Did you, did you find the sideburns in, in the puzzle? No. They're I, in the bottom. They're taped to the bottom. I've got these... Can I use them? Can I please staple them on? That is the key. You can do whatever you want. Oh. What you don't understand is that... Oh. What you don't understand is that I thought it was a flower, but it wasn't, okay? It was part of the rat on the treadmill, and it was this dude's legs watching The Price is Right, okay? And it was part of the blender. And I, I convinced myself for so long that it was a flower. I mean, I spent years and years and years convincing myself that these puzzle pieces added up to a flower. I mean, it wasn't at all. And then once I woke up, I realized... How do I trust other pieces? How do I take new pieces and put them together with with as much you know vigor as I once did? Because what if what if they're not a flower either? What if they're just like they've got to be animal pieces? They might be animal pieces, the pieces of goats. Well, that's what I was trying for. There was like a rat and a goat and the whole thing, and the goats didn't have any hands. And you bought this at Walmart? And that's what I wanted. That's what all I wanted. I mean, it's all I want. I mean, since I was a kid, since I was a kid, it, it just it just I was. Have you never nervous. gotten a puzzle together? Ever? Never. There are all these disjointed pieces that I convince myself to be flowers. You have a serious problem, young man. I know I do. But I don't think I'm much different from anybody else. I bet everybody else has got a bunch of, like, pseudo-flowers in their pockets that really are just, like, pieces of this weird puzzle that aren't supposed to fit together. No. I mean, I hope I'm not alone in this thing, you know. You are. Well, it sure feels that way. You know, when I go through the newsstands and stuff and read the magazines and everybody seems to have their flowers so perfectly put together, you know? Because, see, what they do is, that, like, they can take you in a studio and they can take your photograph and make it look like you've got your pieces puzzled together really well, you know? And they can they can do anything these days. They, and the way you package It's all it, computers. They've got their shit together. Right. They can make it look like you've got your flower together, but they really don't. But it makes the people that don't have their flowers together feel really small and insignificant. You are. But that's what makes all the difference. You're an artist. But I'm not insignificant because my flower isn't any more pressed together than anybody else's flower. I mean, and if, uh, I guess if I had a record company or something that could, like, take my photo and make it look like my flower was together, then I'd be okay. But I'm not, I don't want to do that because then all these people with no flowers pressed together would be coming to me, like, 
treating me like I was somebody who had my flower put together and I don't, and it'd be a big lie. And then I'd be doing Swanson TV dinner ads when I was 15. I'd be a real smug and commit suicide on the Brooklyn Bridge. There wouldn't be much point in that, would it? No. You're an artist. I've told you a hundred times. You see, what you, the part that you don't understand... What is there to not understand? I, 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 it's so hard for me to explain it to you because, see, I, I see that you, you're a bit off, actually. I'm very off. I didn't realize how off I was until I pulled my pieces of puzzle out of my pocket and, and saw for what it really was. Did you try tape? It was stuck together. It's, I wish I could pull them apart. If I could pull them apart, they'd be okay, but I can't. They're stuck together. I see. And I like, came home and showed it to my folks really proud of my flower, and that's when I realized. You should be in college. I should be in college, yeah. I should be taking...